this video we are going to see what is recursive language and what is recursively enumerable language so here the language that we are going to consider are the one that is an unrestricted language that is for which we can construct a turing machine for it a recursive language is one for which when you construct a turing machine like we'll give some input and this is a turing machine if the input is correct it goes to accepting state and again if the input is a wrong one it should goes to a rejection state as i told you like there is a proper acceptance and rejection state in case of a turing machine so whenever we give a input it either enter into a accepting state or it enter into a rejection state so these kind of languages we call it as a recursive language whereas a recursively enumerable language is again you are going to construct a turing machine for it when we give a input if the input is correct it goes to accepting state so the remaining features are not defined properly for example like when the input belongs to the language when the input belongs to the language the uh, turing machine will go to accepting state what if the case when the input does in belongs to the language so there are two possibility one it either the turing machine goes to a rejection state or sometimes it loop itself the turing machine will go for a infinite loop so like these kind of possibilities are there so the acceptance alone is properly defined so when you are just defining the acceptance case we call that as a recursively enumerable language like where the uh, in, like if the input belongs to the language the turing machine accepts the input the result the remaining things are not defined properly whereas a recursively recursive language is for each and every uh, input it either goes to an accepting state or it either goes to a rejection state so a recursive language is one which always halt and recursively enumerable language we should not we can't say anything like that okay